Hi, I'm Kim, and I'm an accessibility advisor at Accessibility Services. When it comes to accommodations, a lot of people ask me about how to talk to their professors. We want you to feel empowered to speak to your professors directly by sharing your letter of accommodation, but we're always here to help. If you'd prefer to have us talk to your professors, we can definitely do that for you. If you feel comfortable speaking to your profs directly, the first thing to consider is when to do so. If you'd like to request your accommodations right away, submit your letter of accommodation at the beginning of the term and try to give them as much notice as possible if you need to miss a class, request an extension, or access accommodations. Some programs ask you to provide your letter of accommodation to a point person in your department or faculty. Speak with your accessibility advisor to review the steps for your program. You also need to think about what your instructors really need to know. What information is relevant to them? Remember, you don't need to give any details about your disability, diagnosis, or personal struggles. Instead, you can talk about your learning needs and any challenges you might face when it comes to meeting your course requirements. You might say something like, I have an academic accommodation that allows me to sit in the front row. Or, if I experience a flare-up of my disability-related symptoms, I might need to ask you for an extension on my work. If you ask your instructor in person, follow up with an email outlining what you discussed. And remember to attach your letter of accommodation, even if you've already shared it. Every time you communicate with your instructors, include your course code and section so they know exactly what class you're in. They probably teach a few. Here are a few do's and don'ts for emailing your profs. Do write a clear subject line so they know exactly why you're writing to them. Do explain your situation concisely and politely. Do finish with a closing sentence, including your full name and your student number. Don't address your instructor by their first name unless they've asked you to. Don't email your instructor for information that can be found in the course syllabus. Don't send an email without proofreading it first. Always check for spelling, grammar, and complete sentences. Professors or instructors need to approve all disability-related extensions. So if your letters of accommodation say that you can ask for extra time to complete assignments, make sure to give your profs enough time to approve it. And remember, extensions aren't guaranteed. It's best to request an extension a week before the original due date, but it may not always be possible. So if a challenging situation comes up and you're not sure how to discuss your accommodations, make an appointment with your accessibility advisor. Remember, we're always here to help. Reach out anytime. We look forward to talking to you.